Hey guys, so this is uh, our first international collaboration. Let's see with whom. Hi, my name is Nicole. So Nicole, you are the first guest of our talk show. Tell us about you. I live in Los Angeles, California in the United States. And before I was laid off due to the coronavirus, I was a private flight attendant. Okay, cool. So Nicole, what do you think about the current situation? The current situation here has been about the same for several weeks now. We're on quarantine and asked to stay home and cover our nose and our mouth with makeshift masks like this when we're out in public places like the grocery store. And unless you're an essential worker, most people are working from home or have been laid off or have had hours dramatically cut. Moving on. So the next question is for you is uh, what are the steps taken by US government to stop this uh, epidemic? The government here is taking lots of different steps to help stop the virus from spreading. President Trump has just recently had a press conference basically laying out different phases of how and when the economy will be rolling back out and has shown interest in trying to move things forward out of quarantine. However, at the state level, California is one of the most liberal of the democratic states here. So our governor, Gavin Newsom, has already said that we will be taking more precaution. Continue social distancing for, um, you know, until they feel certain that things are safe. Cal our governor in California has partnered with Washington State, Oregon, and their plan is to have more testing and faster results. He believes that people need to know that they are safe before things go back to normal and people go out again. So he has also partnered with the head of Disney, Arnold Schwarzenegger, and 80 other business professionals and government officials to be part of overseeing a plan of how to restart the economy. So I feel specifically in California, we're adopting a very creative transition on how to go back to normal after this. Fair enough. So Nicole, what would you like to recommend to everyone so that they can accept from uh, this COVID-19 situation? I don't know for myself personally. I have been trying to reach out to my elders. I'm sorry, for myself personally, I've been reaching out to my elders my parents, my grandparents to make sure they are safe, their needs are met, and I can alleviate them from situations that might put them in danger of contacting the disease. Okay, great. Now, Nicole, I want you to give a positive message to everyone who is watching this video. A positive message for everyone who will watch this video is um, my life um, looked really different just a month ago before the coronavirus virus pandemic came to the United States. I had a lot of time that I've never really had before to really reflect on my life, what I'm doing and who I am. Taking this time to reevaluate a lot of my life's purpose uh, has been really valuable for me, for me to realize how much time I really spent um, on myself and so uh, during this time every day I have women's support groups so I can be there for other people and lift their up other people and it's become a real joy for my life so if you're interested in joining a women's support group I'll definitely share that link with you sure I love to be a part of your women's support group thank you very much it was a fun collaboration with you. Now I want you to tell my viewers how we connect each other. I've actually never met Vinay Timwari, but uh, his openness and willingness to reach out to me uh, on the a complete someone from the complete opposite end of the world to engage and connect really speaks volumes to me about his love and appreciation for humankind. So if you like this video, press the like button and share with all your friends and most importantly, subscribe to Vinyatawari's vlogs. So thank you so much Nicole for being a part of my video. And guys, Nicole is running a woman support group if you are interested. So go check, link is in the description. And guys, most important message for you, stay at home, stay safe and take care of yourself. Thank you so much.